arrive in the mail looking like official government documents. That's right, but in this 7 on your side consumer alert, Audrey Godfrey found that looks are deceiving in this Colorado case, and they're also at the heart of the scam hitting small business owners across the country. These forms claiming to be from the Colorado Corporate Compliance Office looked authentic, at least to Scott Harris. Like any small business, I get an awful lot of these from the state and federal government. And I thought, uh, I really didn't give any thought. I'd completed the form and mailed it back in. Harris runs a small consulting firm. They had information about uh, the name of the company, uh, the date we incorporated, um, you know, other details like that. But the whole thing is a scam that's actually gaining ground and specifically targeting people starting their own businesses. It's asking for some kind of periodic report. Um, and what they're offering is a service to provide documents to file with the state that aren't even really required. In this case, Harris never sent the fee in, but hundreds of others did. Inspectors say if you own a small business, do your homework. It's not uh, a compliance issue that you're familiar with. There's certainly going to be a phone number or an email address that you can contact to, to ensure that it is something. Most states have very helpful websites. You can look that up. You can call them to see if it's a legitimate mailing. I'll certainly in the future, you know, uh, just pay closer attention to them. And some final advice from officials. Always check with your state's attorney general or your local Better Business Bureau to see if the mailing you've received is legit. Atria Godfrey, ABC 7 News.